Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KJ48, and welcome to Volcanoids Early Access. Volcanoids is a first-person base-building survival game set in a steampunk era where humans and technology meet. And I don't think we're friendly. Explore a volcanic island, operating giant drills, and enduring eruptions triggered by mechanical beings. Uh, this is $20 right now on Steam. Or, uh, sorry, it's normally $20 on Steam. Right now it is for $16. And it's going to be $16 till February 5th. Let's get started. So I haven't messed around with multiplayer. But it does have multiplayer. I played this game like a year or two ago. Maybe even three. Uh, you know, I don't think they had multiplayer back then. Honestly, I don't remember. But they do have multiplayer. I don't know how good it is because I haven't played it. I'm just doing single player, but it is nice to know it's there. Okay, so here we are, and we have a quest right now. We have to talk to the captain, so let's talk to the captain. All right, craft drill ship core, so we got a quest. Good day, sailor. Cogs, mysterious robots that took over our island, possesses technology superior to ours. It is clear. Uh, first step must be reverse engineering their tech uh, and increase our odds. Find pieces of their technology and research them so that we learn how to capture their drill ships. Uh, massive machines they use for transportation. All right, I will accept the quest. All right, so we have a bunch of quests. We have to leave the submarine, and I believe there should be a ladder over here. All right, so we'll climb up here. Now, if you might notice in the very middle of the screen, it says Volcano Eruption. If we're not underground, within 14 minutes, we die game over. Okay, so we have to um, we have to do some work here. So first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna pull out our pickaxe, and so now we can see nodes. So I'm gonna grab some of this coal, and I think over to my left there's some copper. So we're gonna come over here and grab the copper. All right, cool. Mining copper, we mine the coal. Very good. All right, so there's going to be a we need to dissolve it. We need to scavenge. Destroyed production module. Now this is our technology that we have to kind of reverse engineer and we might have to deal with some robots along the way But that should not be a problem We do have a we've got a six shooter. What's 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 gonna be the problem? What could go wrong? The only thing is we can't see where we need to go without our pickaxe out So we will continue using our pickaxe and uh, you know continue along this game Um, like I said, I played this game I think my last time I played it was 2019 and I played it before then um, so I've been playing this game for a little while, and it's really come a long way. It really has come a long way. It's basically, you know, we're going to get a drill ship, and we can go underground to avoid the eruption enemies and stuff. And then we just have to, uh, you know, tech up and build up our ship and stuff. It's pretty cool. Um, I don't think there's any food in the game, but we do have to worry about our health. So that's going to be fun. And it looks like we got some robots over here, so let's take them out. What's up, bro? I said, sup, bro. Okay, he's down. We got another one right here shooting at us. There we go. You wait for the X. Because sometimes they get stunned and you, like, think they're dead, but they're not. Wait for the X to pop up. That way you know they're dead. Alright, so let's go ahead and take this as well. What did we get from him? We got, uh, these are copper ingots. We got those from mining the ore and they drop, I, actually they drop, uh, copper scrap metal. Um, we got a builder head. Okay. Using research and we got some copper bolts. All right. So we're going to come right. This is what we're looking for. Okay. There we go. And there should be another one around here as well. Take that. Um, I feel, oh, there's the other one. Okay. So there's going to be two in each one of these towns. And I think during every eruption, they respawn. I think you could also break in these doors. Maybe not that one. Can we break in this one? No. I know where there's one door I can break in for sure. This one right here. Yep, see how it's got the yellow around it? So that means you can break into it. So we're going to come down here. And this right here is like the research station. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to research the Intel production. That's what we got right here. Destroyed production module. And I guess we're going to, like, learn from it. So there we go. I'm not going to research the other one. Uh, someone in the game's Discord, like, taught me a lot of this. And they said, don't research the other one yet. So I'm not really sure why, but I will heed their advice. What is this? Oh, yeah, this is where you can, um... There we go. We could uh, turn 
um, copper ingots in, or sorry, sorry, we could use copper ore and coal to make copper ingots. We can use copper scrap and coal to make um, copper ingots. We can also do sulfur and gunpowder as well. There we go. Don't forget to take that stuff out of there. You have to take item. All right, cool. Unequip pickaxe. Use submarine. Use submarine system for production. All right, what's submarine? Oh boy, hold on. It's getting real. Oh boy. These guys only take two shots. Make sure you loot them. It's really nice when enemies like drop stuff. You know, I always appreciate that. All right, so there's got to be a... Oh, yeah. So I think a submarine has come up here, and I think it's the enemy, like the robot submarine. No, not submarine. I'm sorry, drill ship. Uh, no, it's not up yet. Okay, so they're telling me to go back to the submarine to build stuff, and then eventually um, I'll have to take over one of their drill ships. Uh, I think I need, like, a core or something. Kind of like in Imperion, you need a core to take over a ship. So I think once we get to the submarine, we'll be able to make one of those and we should be good to go. So we got about nine minutes before the eruption. So we got to, we got to be moving. You know what I'm saying? All right. So this is the production table. We're going to go ahead and make a drill ship core, basic drill ship core for small drill ships, install a drill ship core upgrade slot. And that'll, that's like a way I can take it over. Okay. And did I take it? I don't see it in my inventory. I always like to make sure I take these things. Well, I guess I already have it, so. Visit the captain for objectives. Claim drill ship. Uh, we've received a distress call of a heavily damaged drill ship that will soon surface closer to our location. Destroy the cogs and claim the drill ship. Yeah, so it's, there's a drill ship about to surface. We're going to kill everything and take it. Wait, can I take all this? Wait, dump all? Is this all in my inventory? That's not my inventory. I don't know. I don't know what this is. I don't know. Whatever. I'm not going to worry about it. Freaking. <laughs> we're about to be wiped off the planet if I don't get my own drill ship. So. And we're kind of taking a while here. So. Anyway. The cogs. The cogs are the robots. In case. You know. In case you didn't get that. The cogs are going to surface over here with a drill ship. So we're going to go over there. We're going to wipe them out. We're going to take the drill ship. And then we're going to go underground so we don't get killed. Uh. Hold on. This is really stupid by the way. I just, I'm just curious what's down here. Okay, so this is the same exact setup. Oh, I didn't notice this. Come on. Do we just loot it? <laughs> okay, <laughs> I guess we just loot it. Uh, okay, we got a banner. Very cool. All right, let's go. Enough playing around. This is not the time for games. We got to kill some cogs. It sounds almost like a like a slur. You dirty cogs. Hold up. Oh, I'm about to die. Oh my god, I almost died. Well, time to heal up with this green stuff. <laughs> Just spray all this green stuff all over me. Okay. Loot. Just got some shotgun shells, I think. Buckshot. Hell yeah. Alright, so now we have to replace all these walls. So, I kind of forget how to do that. I think I need to come over here. It probably tells me up here. But I'm going to go to module. No. Uh, look at the press left. Uh, drill ship will be installed. Core. Oh, I need to take over the, the drill ship first. Um, not sure I need to place this. There we go. Alright, it's my drill ship. Contact the captain. Okay, so we need... To, oh, yeah, we need to make these things. Okay, so I think those are made in... Here? Upgrade ammo component. No, consumable. Okay, so I got one of those. Now we now we switch to the um to the wrench. And then we simply uh wait, what the hell is that? I don't know what that was. Uh replacement. Yeah, replacement. What the hell? Walk to the drill ship storage, click on the menu button, take the breach replacement. Oh, okay, there was already breach replacements in there. There we go. Okay. And now we are good to go. I think we need to fix some more up here. Yep. There's breaches on the top too. I don't know why the banner large is there. It's kind of annoying. 
There we go. Congratulations, you've completed the tutorial. More quests are available on the radio. Now you're on your own. Discover what happened to the island. You need to upgrade the drill ship in order to reach new areas. Captain offers additional tutorial quests. When feeling lost, contact him. Press F1 for help. Okay, great. Well, let's get another quest. Why not? We still got five minutes. All right, here we go. Turret. Uh, build a turret module. Uh, once you travel farther, there is a high risk of cogs will destroy your drill ship. Make sure you can defend it by building a turret module. Once turret module is deployed, it automatically shoots at enemies. Okay. Okay. You don't really need that because you can send your ship underground on its own. But still, I think making a turret module would be pretty cool. All right. First things first. Let's, uh, should we get underground? Now we got a little bit of time. Let's come to this thing right here. And this will allow us to make copper ingots. Take items, copper ingots. Remember, these are made from ore. These are made from the scrap. Okay. I don't know if the drill actually needs power. I thought it did. But I'm not really I'm not really sure anymore. Alright, so we're just gonna do that. And let that do its copper ingots. Is there anything I want to make in here? Uh, well, I know one thing I want to do. I gotta come up to the research table thingy. And go to schematics. Okay, so once you're in schematics, it'll say at the bottom what you need. Uh, you need Intel production tier one and five sulfur powder. I'm not sure why I don't have Intel production tier one. I'm pretty sure that's what I did. Maybe I used that for something else. Okay, I used the um, production module to get the drill for the, uh, the drill core thing for me to take this thing over. Okay, fair enough. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to come in here and we're going to... Uh, can we research to unlock new technology? Two builder head. Um, Intel production tier one. Intel. I don't know what the difference is between these two. Um, I'm just going to do that one for now. And I think we're going to dive underground. So in order to dive underground, you simply do this. Boom! And then we're just going to, you know, stay underground for the eruption. I think we can watch it with a, with a periscope or whatever. Periscope, right? That's the word. And there we go. I'm going underground. Now you can just sit in here. Now we're on an angle here because we're going down. So. Alright. So is this th so I don't know what's going to keep working. And what's not. When we go underground. Certain things you're not going to be able to do. When you're underground. I guess I'll do this one too. I don't really know. <clears throat> I don't really know. What the. Yeah. Yeah. Let's just do that. Okay. So now the um, eruption is starting to happen, and we could look at the through the periscope if we so choose, which I don't really need to. I guess I'll show you guys, but all right. So can we make a? No, we can't make anything yet. All right, so we need to come over here. Now, damn it, I don't remember what to do with this thing now. Oh, I remember. We got to unlock with the schematics. All right, so we're gonna take this one schematics. We've got the Intel production tier one, and we need five sulfur powder you know what i don't think we got five sulfur powder yet so what we're gonna do is we're gonna drive this thing around underground and we're gonna get some copper and some and some uh, sulfur powder powder now when i last played this game this was not a thing right here so is that how many sulfur is that come on get the damn sulfur there you go okay i think that's fine i don't know if this ship actually takes fuel like i think it does but I don't know if, I don't know where there's like anything telling me about the fuel of the ship. Got a map. We got this thing right here, which is a menu. Drill ship. Yeah, I don't know. I, I guess I don't know. I'll figure it out. Okay. So now that we got the sulfur powder, we can go ahead and do this, right? No. Finished. It's not finished. What what the did I get sulfur powder or did I get sulfur? Oh, that's right. Okay, so the ship grabbed the sulfur, so it's not in my inventory. It's in the ship. So, there's that. All right, so we'll do that. And there we go. Oh, everything's blowing up. Oh, I can't use it. I got to find soft spot. All right, whatever. Trust me, stuff is blowing up. Would have preferred to show you, but... All right, and now that we've got the sulfur, we should be able to come up here and unlock the schematics for more items. There we go. 
cool. And that's going to allow us to make... I know it allows, allows us to make doors and windows and stuff. So maybe we could start expanding this thing. Because this thing is really, you know, pretty freaking cramped. No joke. Why does it say one meter there for that? It's weird. Okay. Let's grab some more stuff. Alright, so we've got a wrecked ship here. I believe that's on the surface. Because I'm pretty sure I can't, like, go to the surface here. Because they're there. Let me see if it... Can't use the periscope either. I guess you need, like, soft... Soft dirt. There's hard rock. I would think soil would allow me to use a periscope. Nah, I guess it's gotta be, like, soft soil or something. Oh, something's ringing. Where is it? There we go. Two quests. Repair damage modules. Re repair storage modules. The storage module on the on the side of the ship has been damaged. Uh, produce and use repair tool to fix it. Make sure you have the wrench equipped. Okay. I will accept that. And then what's the other one? Module based production. We have we have long seen cogs use large machines to build their drill ships called modules for production. It's time to harness this technology for us as well. They do not require coal, but they need a steady supply of energy generated by your drill ship's boiler or coal plant. Okay. Do I even have one of those? Like, I don't know. I'm not really sure. Okay. Can we go to safe grounds? Okay. Go to the surface. Man, two more quests. Gather destroyed modules. Got it. And research uh, production. Okay. Got it. All right. First things first. Let's get that. Let's get the turret, man. I don't even know how to make it. Um, let's come in here. See, now we should be able to make doors and windows and stuff. Probably there's some other things in here I didn't have before. Um, let's make some ammo. Missing items. Okay, so what do we need? Copper bullet casings and black powder. Black powder. Uh, we need coal for that. I don't have any coal on me. I feel like I should have some coal on me. Wait, hold on. Yeah, we got some problems out here. Okay, I should have reloaded. You're dead. You're dead. Okay. Alright, we need some coal. Let's reload this. Yeah, we need bullets, like, now. Like, right now. Alright, so coal should be in here. Alright, we'll take everything out of here. And coal. Coal. Sulfur. Wait, sulfur? Wait, sulfur ore, sulfur powder needs, oh, that's black powder, okay, I see now, okay, my bad, for some, I thought that was like, you know, like in seven days to die, you re, well, I guess you don't refine anything in seven days to die, I figured you have sulfur, you refine it, you have coal, you refine it, you put both of those together, and you make gunpowder, um, that's not really the case, you refine the sulfur into, um, so you take the sulfur ore and refine it to sulfur powder, but you don't do the same with, with um, you don't do the same with the gunpowder, uh, with the, with the coal. Okay. Got it. Alright, I had to go to components, make the bullet casings to make the ammo. It's, it's coming back to me. It's coming back to me. Alright, so let's go ahead and go to module, and we're gonna make a turret, pistol turret module. When deployed, pistol turret automatically shoots enemies within range. I would also like a door module and a door, because I'm gonna put one on this side of the ship as well. Okay. Come on. Alright, so now we'll put this right here. Uh, mouse wheel, there we go. And now we simply need a door. Come on with the door, bro! And then we put the door in. I gotta get rid of this ba banner. Like, I don't really need it for anything. Alright, let's put it in here. Get the hell out of my inventory. I'll mess around with it later, I just don't want to deal with it right now. Uh, there we go. Okay. Alright, so now we got a door on this side too. So I can go on both sides to shoot dirty, dirty robots. Alright, so now I've got this thing. So, module repair. Not available. Okay, now I'm not really sure what to do with this, to be honest. Alright, I see what to do with it now. It goes in the place of one of these, like, slots. Like, that's a slot. That's a slot. That's a slot. And it can go right there. I don't know if it can go on the roof. What if it can go on the roof? How do I get up to the roof? 
Can I even get up to the roof? Alright, I'm not gonna worry about it. We'll just put it right here. There we go. And that's how it, it deploys. And now we just need to give it some ammo. So the ammo is gonna be right here, the pistol turret ammo. There we go. Get a few of that. I'll just go ahead and make uh, more bullet casings. And if we can make more of this, I will, but I can't. Nothing's in here. Yeah, we have to go mine. We have to do more mining. Alright, so does it have its ammo? Do I have to put its ammo somewhere? Uh, where would I put its ammo? Oh, see, ammo's right there. See, I don't, like, see of any way to, like, put ammo into it. I think I just undeployed it. There we go. Uh, so I'm thinking maybe put ammo in the ship. Uh, so where is it? It's right there. Yep. There we go. Now it's got ammo. Alright, cool. Alright, I'm not taking any more quests. I got too many into this. Okay. Oh, well, it seems pretty effective. Took a little bit of damage, but that's okay. Alright. Now I feel like I can do some mining. The problem is I don't have one on this, this side. So, I think we need to make another one. Alright, uh, modules, we need um, some copper plates, uh, copper plates are made in the same place, I'm getting used to it, I'm getting used to it, some copper plates, I think shooting more guys, might as well go loot them, I think it seems pretty, uh, pretty effective, I'm not gonna lie, like, I'm kind of impressed, we need more coal, we need more coal, we need more ammo, that's what we need. More ammo! Did I hear something? I feel like I heard something. Alright, so let me show you another thing you can do. I don't really love the amount of ammo that's in there. So what you can do is, you can hold G, and it will remote send this thing down. Okay? And then you just hold G again and bring it up. And that way it won't be getting shot. Just make sure you're close to the... These are sites that the ships can come up. Make sure you're close to the site so it doesn't pop up. Oh, look at that. More destroyed modules. Yeah, I got a lot of stuff to do, man. I'm, I'm pretty excited. The game, I'm having like... I don't know. There's just something about it that I kind of feel like it's hard to understand. Maybe it's just me. But um, I'm getting it. And when I'm get, and now that I'm getting it, I'm really kind of liking it like a lot. So we're just going to go ahead and grab some coal now. Got a little building here. I'm not sure if there's going to be anything interesting, but you never know. There we go. Break down to this thing. Probably going to be the same stuff down there that's always down there. But, um, okay, yeah, that, I mean, that's some good stuff. I wonder if you, I wonder if I could take that stuff apart to get, like, parts for it. Um, okay. I uh, will use this because why not? Okay, we'll let it do its thing. Look around up here. All right, pretty interesting. Looks like we got a lot of time to stay up here too. Although I kind of want sulfur, so I'm thinking about going back down down below. Man, look at that. Hell yeah, 15. That's what I'm talking about. All right, I'm gonna leave the rest of this stuff alone. I could do that in my own ship. Dude, what the hell is this? It's some kind of mining operation or something. Look at this. Look, there's some, There's a lot of stuff back there. Oh my god. Uh, I do not have a lot of ammo, though. I feel like I should have more of the ammo than that. Right? Alright, whatever. I'll look at it later. Let's not worry about it. Is there a light? I don't have a light. Alright, well, let's check this place out. I wonder if I could hide in here from the... Uh, from the uh, explosion. Uh, it doesn't look like there's much here. Oh, never mind. Oh, I, I need a light. You know... <sighs> yeah. yeah, I think we'll come down here another time. Like, where I have an entire episode to play with. And let me see if I can get some kind of, like, um... Some kind of light or something. So you guys can actually see. Alright, yeah, I really need sulfur. Where the hell am I going to find sulfur? All right, you know what? The hell with it. Right here, we got the sulfur ore veins, and we've also got some production modules we can grab. So, 
Yeah, the sulfur usually spawns around the uh, the pools of lava. I prefer not to tangle with anybody, though, to be honest. Because I don't have a lot of ammo. Unfortunately. Oh, okay. Be careful. It's getting awful hot. Alright, looks like we're going to have to use some ammo here no matter what. Oh, there's sulfur right there. I wonder if I can actually get to the sulfur without, like, burning myself. Might not be able to. I wonder if the only way you can get sulfur is, like... Underground. I was told if you switch to your pick, you can like reload faster. Doesn't really seem to be the case. Maybe just like that. No, does not seem to be the case. Unless I'm just doing it wrong. Which could be. Very well could be. Okay. And let's grab this sucker. Wait, what? Inventory? Oh, damn it! Crap, you hear that? That's, um... That's a ship. Alright, I'm gonna get the hell out of here. We gotta be careful, though. If that's an enemy ship, I... You know... I I'm gonna mess with enemy ships. I just don't want to do it right now. Because it's scary. <laughs> Makes me scared. Okay, so we go this way. Um, don't call your ship if uh, you know if it's too like if you're not close enough to the to the pickup site. Just hold off. Make sure you're pretty close. And then once you feel like you're close enough, hold down G, and your ship will come up. There you go, and it'll tell you where it's coming up. The harbor. There it is. Cool. That is so cool. You could remote like send your ship away so it doesn't get attacked. That is freaking cool. I went back and dropped off everything in the ship. And I'm trying to get this sulfur node. But it's kind of guarded. But I did kill a couple of these guys. And there's more around. I just don't know if they're going to attack. Seems to be okay. Okay, come on. Come on. Yeah, give me that sulfur. Hell yeah. All right, so now we're going to come over here and get those uh, other production nodes, or uh, research nodes. The gunplay in this game feels pretty good, I'm not going to lie. It really does. Man, I still only have one freaking round left. Three rounds left. Unbelievable. Well, that's what I need to sulfur for. All right, let's grab this stuff in GTFO. I did leave my ship up. So I'm hoping... The problem with the ship is it only has the guns on the one side. So if, like, they attack from the other side, that could be an issue. Um, they haven't done it yet. Doesn't mean they won't. It just means they haven't. Leave me alone! Is he gonna chase me all the way back to my ship? No, it's his funeral. If he does. Because my ship's gonna tear him a new one. Should probably grab that copper. I have a lot of copper already. I'm okay on copper for for now. Honestly, what I really need is um is sulfur more than anything. Alright, it seems like he stopped chasing me. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna make some freaking ammo. Cause damn. Well I completely forgot about the <laughs> the freaking volcano, man. Thank god I was making a bunch of noise. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. So I don't know what's gonna stop working once I'm uh you know, under the ground, but doesn't seem. Can this work? Yeah, this is this will work. Cool. All right, cool. So we're gonna make a bunch of black powder. I'm gonna make some ammo, and I do think I'm gonna call this one here, guys. If you want to see more of this, uh, make sure you uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Now you know it's coming. I gotta give you the speech. Um, I know about half of you watching my videos are not subscribed, but you're watching my videos on a regular basis. Uh, it would be cool if you subscribe. You know, if you want to, I hope today uh, I will have earned your subscription. Because when you watch someone's video and you're subscribed, YouTube loves it. Really promotes that channel, so that would be great. Also, I want to let you guys know, I have a Discord. Um, it's in the description of every video I do. And we're going to start doing community game nights. Um, come on Discord, find out about the community game nights. Last, last night was last week. 
Yeah, they're every Saturday at 6 p.m. Last week was our first one, and it was pretty dope. We played Ph Phasmophobia, and I played it for the first time, and I actually had a good time. So, guys, hope you hope to see you on Discord. Hope you like the video. I hope you subscribe, all that good stuff. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time, and until then, take it easy.